fuel warning light. Whether you have a fuel warning light or whatever you're flying has a low fuel indicator, whatever it is, you never want to get to the point that that light comes on. You want to use good, proper fuel planning. And it's easy for me to stand here and say that. And I know I've ran myself low a couple times, lower than what I wanted to. And it's easy to plan properly, but then you have weather issues, maintenance issues, whatever the case may be, things that are unplanned for. So you got to be reasonable. You got to be thinking on your feet. And just if you have to sit down in a field and call somebody to bring you some fuel or come get you a ride, then that's what you got to do. Don't get to the point that you got the low fuel light coming on. You don't want to do it.